Batting, all that throwing attacks on the ground, no air attack, okay? Free fight, free fight, shake Come on! <laughs> Here's your tail of the tape, take a look, records, you're ready. wait. You ready? Ready, go! Both coming from middle America. Hey, we all Midwest kids, we're here to fight, even in the island. Good kick, you started off. Nick Petri says right back at you. Right back, exactly, Garrett throws a front kick. One thing that Garrett Olson said, he said, I didn't mind taking a fight on this short notice. I feel like I can flip the switch, quote, unquote. Yep, exactly. You know what it's going to take for Drew? Drew has to go out there and stop that. Every second this fight goes on, Garrett's getting more and more momentum. He's feeling like, I belong here. I belong. I, I, hey, I'm not doing so bad. Hey, I'm in this fight. Next thing you know, they're throwing things. Their confidence is going. What Drew needs to do right now is be the bigger name, be the icon, so to speak. Pop him, deflate his balloon, and make it a tough time for him. Take your time, Garrett. 33 years of age, Olsen coming in. And 22 years young. It's ridiculous. Young bucks. <laughs> <laughs> now you're saying that. Exactly. You used to be one of them. I am, exactly. Well, Garrett Olsen kind of... Minimalizing any potential damage that McPetrie's right, could lay on. Yeah, but he also, he, cut, he stole some points by being active and throwing even those little shots. Remember, at the end of the day, we're not trying to go to a decision, but those are three people sitting out there. They're, it's their opinions that you have to sway. Acting, acting, acting. It sucks, but hey, it's part of it. So by looking busy, even in the slightest, it's giving you that edge. McPetrie's just lurking, slowly closing that gap. Olsen, who says he's very comfortable with his striking these days, being active. Oh, just avoided a big bomb there. Yeah, Drew, Drew is definitely wanting to throw one big master, monster bomb. Absolutely. And it'll just be up to can Garrett get out of the way. He knows it's coming. It's just can Drew do it. That inside five kick. You can hear that one from far away here in the Blaisdell Center. Those pops mic up very well here in this well, game. Tell you what, it's a beautiful sound. I'm glad I'm not in there receiving that thing, that's for sure. Looks like McFedries is just sort of waiting his turn, waiting to pull the he's trigger. Waiting. You know what, he is hitting, but he's got a lot to concede. Garrett is just getting more and more confident. Can Drew come back in and land a bomb? Obviously he hits hard because he gets Garrett clinching just about instantly. I don't know if Drew's trying to save his lungs, save, you know what I mean? Maybe he's feeling some jet lag, or he's just looking for that one shot. But you know what the problem is, is the time is ticking down, and you don't land that one shot, Garrett's going to steal the round by being the busier fighter. Oh, that was a stiffy. Good coming shots. From, coming from the left foot of McFedrick. How about Olsen? Got to watch that. It's as if McFedries is thinking, you know what, I have X number of bullets and I'm going to make sure that I'm up close to my target. Well, you know, and I'm hoping that he's not too busy watching and aiming. You know, the Drew back in the day, he would just come in there and explode. Now he's, there goes the other side. Right from McFedries. And McFedries starting to drop some bombs. I guess he wanted to get punched one time to get out of And he's looking to close the deal. Can Olsen survive this onslaught? So far, he is surviving. Drew needs to take a deep breath, relax. Don't let him rest. And Yuji Shimano says, get on up. Yep. Drew's got to watch it. He's looking tired out there a little bit. He's looking a little lethargic. Well, that was vintage massacre that we saw just for a few moments there. Oh, that was straight anger. And you know see? How many of those can you take? He's winning this thing, Zachary. Yeah. Hands up, you've got to throw something. Back this kid off you. Yeah, that punch was in orbit for a little while before it happened. Yeah. Garrett's doing the right thing. Showing no fear, pacing a little bit, throwing bombs, and he's just looking to catch it. Going upstairs. And it's working, it's positive. Push kick there, push kick him. Every feint, everything he does, it's just positive. Under a minute to go here in round one. I like to see Drew come in with more jabs and then boom with the left hand. Olsen pulling out all the stops here. In and why not? Hey, two days ago he's in Minnesota. Chilling. <laughs> he does have that why not attitude, it appears, in there. Hey, what do I have to lose, right? Exactly. Comes in with that roundhouse right again. Catches nothing but air. Oh, there's a shot. 
Al Lieberwani shot a straight thunder right there. Had that been on the other side to deliver, would Ten seconds to go here in round one. Yuji Shimano will stand up again. A few parting shots perhaps coming up right here. Well, you know what? Everything you throw, he's out, he's scaring him. But he's just not throwing enough, and Garrett's getting away and stuff. So you look at that first round, and certainly Olsen was the guy a little bit more active, at least in attempting punches. Does he get the round, in your opinion? Again, you're, what are you trying to do? You're trying to you convince three people that you're, that you're winning each round. Acting. Yeah. You want it? Take a look at some of the action from that first round. See, these are just shots. I mean, even though, look, he hits him with an uppercut, and that may do, man. He finally uncorks some shots and gets him down, trying to put him away. Garrett does a great job of getting his feet, getting the guard, pushing him away. And I think at this point, Drew realizes, okay, maybe I'm feeling a little sluggish. Maybe I, I, I want to save some gas. Time to stand him up, and you know what I mean? We'll try again. You've talked about, though, and you've gone through it. As a veteran fighter, at some points throughout your career, you start to feel perhaps a little bit more skittish about pulling the trigger. It's kind of mentally fighting through that, isn't it? It's not? just, you know, and that's the thing. I mean, one car wreck after another, you just don't want to get behind the wheel anymore. You just like, you know, and then the older you get, the wars you get into, you start staring. And you want everything to be that perfect movie shot that that textbook beautiful shot you got to get back to how you were when you were young you put three on his arms just to get that fourth one on his chin doesn't matter you're throwing them to throw him good left hand he was throwing it right there and he's going to throw it again trying to lay some knuckles now drew mcfedrick gotta watch the kick Wilson using those up kicks to protect himself there you but go. now mcfedrick has his back Gotta watch his legs and not cut the chuck out. Make sure the ones that are doing a good shot. Garrett, he seems like he's there. He just, you know, in this situation, you don't want to give up your neck. You, you already given up your back, so now you've got to try and you're gonna catch 22. You want to get out of there, but you don't want to look like you know you got to intelligently defend yourself, and you don't want the referee to dive in and stop it. So it's, you know, it's a catch 22. You want to jump up, but you don't want to. Open yourself up. There you go. Good job. It's time to forward. Little butt scoot. This has been the routine here for the first yeah, round. Drew's breathing through his mouth a little bit. But you know what? I mean, there he fires a hard right. Comes back and have a cut. Wilson on the attack, but now he's on his back. And deliberately. It almost looks like he sat down for this. I thought he was looking for a go-go for a minute. See, I got some jujitsu terms. I don't like <laughs> Olsen does have wrestling experience, was a college wrestler. Well, right now what he has, he's got a lot of heart and he's got a lot of momentum and he's feeling like, he, you know, he, he's got a lot of confidence in this fight right now. I see one guy getting pressure and Drew's starting to fatigue. Drew, it's going to boil down to one shot. Awkward sequence there for Olsen. McFedry's able to escape the single leg. That part of the tent by Olsen. And he sits back again. And that draws the ire of the fans here at the Blaisdell Arena. Yeah. You know, that's for the referee. Jump in, stand it up. Make it happen. There you go. Make it quick. Yeah, but you know what? That's the one thing I love about Hawaii, man. They've always been a well not the knowledgeable crowd they always have been you better come in here correct man you got to come in here real and come in here to fight you want to earn these these people's respect these fans have been hungry for a fight card like this for some time this is the first time in a while that hawaii has served as the backdrop for something of this magnitude pro elite bringing big time mma back to the islands these fans are appreciative of it you can feel yep. the electricity in here yeah it's always been something to be able to come over here those roundhouse rights are uh, getting a little bit slower each and every time out of the palm of Garrett Olson. Yeah, and it's just a matter of Drew, you know, like I said, biting down and see if he can set something up. Garrett's got to do the same, though. He's got to, both of them got to be active. He needs to get his hands up. He obviously doesn't like Drew's power. So flick these things that you're flicking, but just you got to stay a little more active. Again, don't let these judges think you're tired. And don't let your opponent think you're tired. Man, he's seeing it now. You're going to counter off that. Fedri's measuring it up. 
being very meticulous in his punch selection. Punish his body here. He's thinking wide open. Punish his body. He's kind of holding on to it, keeping it in the holster. A straight left from Olsen. Big right by Olsen, kind of deflected away. Good oh, 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 oh. followed up with the right. McBeck will be the chance again to finish it. Work in the body, work in the face. And it Here we go. Drew McBeck closes the foot on Garrett Olsen. I'm sure in the back of Drew's mind he went, finally. But Garrett, hey man, don't hang your head. 